Here's what I want you to take this morning in, in putting this into your life. First of all, true repentance leads us into a real relationship with God. Repentance is the thing that opens up the window of God's blessings. If, if faith is the doorknob then, or the key, then repentance is the doorknob. You, you, you need both to open up a door. There's faith, right? We place our faith in him, but real faith is always going to have repentance attached to it. We're going to realize that we need a life of repentance. Now listen to me. People don't understand, but this is one of the main themes in all of Scripture. And I'm going to show you right now. So when you read, like Hosea, and you read the other prophets, they were trying to call the people back into repentance. Okay, pastor, that's fine. That's Old Testament. Well, in the New Testament, when you get into the first messenger God sends out there is John the Baptist. Okay? Listen to what John the Baptist says. Matthew 3, verses 1 to 2. In those days, John the Baptist came preaching in the wilderness of Judea. What was he preaching? Repent, for the kingdom of heaven is at hand. Amen. Okay? Jesus comes on the scene, right? What does Jesus preach? Matthew chapter 4, verse 17. From that time, Jesus began to preach, saying what? That sounds like John the Baptist's message. Re Repent for the kingdom of heaven is at hand.